Hello, and welcome to our maintenance video series. In this one-part video series, you will learn the best maintenance routine to follow to take proper care of your embroidery machine. Maintaining your embroidery machine is very simple. The most important maintenance that needs to be completed is lubricating the rotary hook. Before cleaning or oiling, we recommend turning off your machine. To clean and maintain the rotary hook, start by removing the bobbin case from the rotary hook. Clean any lint of thread in the area using a lint brush or dust-off spray. Then, add two or three drops of machine oil to the rotary hook. Now you can insert the bobbin case back into the rotary hook and close the bobbin housing unit. To ensure the machine runs smoothly, repeat this process twice a day if you're planning on running the machine for eight hours a day. Once or twice a week, remove the needle plate and clean around the trimmer knives with a soft brush, an air compressor with a moisture filter, or an approved canned compressed gas product, such as Dust Off. Once a week, pass a business card or a piece of paper through the bobbin case slit to clean any lint buildup. Each week, place a drop of oil directly on the needle bar through the slots in the needle case. Alternate each week. One week, lubricate the upper needle bar section, and the next week, the lower needle bar section. Once a week, oil the opening on the needle plate. For this section, we recommend turning on the machine and setting it to needle one in order to see the opening on the right side of the machine head. Add two to three drops of oil every week to that section. Then, add two to three drops of oil to the metal rail of the machine head. Now, move your machine head to needle 15 and place two to three drops of oil on the other side of the rail. Once every three to five months, apply white lithium grease to the black metal bar on the machine head. Also, apply white lithium grease to the wheels located on the back of your machine head. Once every three to five months, apply white lithium grease to the color change cam. You will need to first remove the metal plate placed above the color change cam by loosening the attached screw. Then apply grease to the color change cam area. Place the cover back over the color change cam and tighten the screw before proceeding. Keep in mind, be sure not to over oil. After oiling, stitch on a test swatch before returning to production to assure excess oil doesn't stain garments. Thank you for watching the maintenance video series. Now that you know how to care properly for your machine, it's time to start embroidering. Good luck. If you like what you see, like this video and subscribe to our channel for more helpful information and tips.